with Blake Johnson starts now. Good evening. Victorians are soaking through one of the wettest Christmas days on record. Melbourne copped a drenching and parts of the state face a flood emergency. Thousands of homes have been left without power as our SES heroes respond to more than 600 calls for help. Santa's orange helpers sacrificing their day to help flood hit Victorians as the state faced a Christmas washout. Kyneton in the firing line after 55 millimetres fell. 140 kilometres north in Wedderburn, the deluge was even heavier. Residents waking up to a summer soaking. This is the biggest it's ever been in all the floods we've had up to here. It's never got up that far before. I woken up to um, looking out my window and found water over the road. I was more worried about my car because my car nearly went underwater. It got up to just under my number plate. The road into town drenched. We've woken up this morning and the town's cut off and in flood again. 170 millimetres of rain fell in 24 hours. This morning, parts of the town were underwater. Something you never thought he'd do, canoeing on the Wedderburn footy ground. Some vehicles that are still driving into floodwaters where our crews are having to endanger not only themselves, but people are endangering themselves. Emergency watch and act warnings were issued for residents in Wedderburn and St Arnold. Overnight, Denali has seen its wettest day on record. Locals seeking refuge in the pub. Craig, our publican here at Wedderburn, he's just a magnificent guy. And people that couldn't get in for Christmas lunch, he said, well, we'll give you Christmas lunch tomorrow. Wet and stormy weather was widespread. We are likely to see some December records broken in terms of rainfall values across 24 hours. The SES received 646 call-outs for trees down, building damage and flooding. The highest number of calls for help were in Echuca. 20,000 homes were without power due to wild storms on Christmas Eve. By today, that number was just over 6,000. The weather was felt around the city too. A cemetery in Melton was underwater, the Yarra River at capacity, and residents in the west hit with damaging hailstones on the M80 Ring Road. The wild weather isn't over yet. Gippsland residents are being warned to stay on high alert with heavy rain and possible storms set to hit the region tomorrow. From Melbourne out through Gippsland become the target zones for some heavier rain and possible storms on Boxing Day. A reminder for Victorians to stay safe during the late December drenching. Ainsley Kosh, 7 News.